So the, the first major benefit that I could tell you is I have two soldiers in my formation that have been in the Guard for over 30 years, and they say this is by far the coolest thing they have ever gotten to do. The, 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 the mission is great. The location, just going to the Philippines on its own is awesome. And all of my soldiers have been able to go out there and get to see things that they would have never gotten to see had they not joined the National Guard. The second thing is training. So we're training with the Filipino Armed Forces, the, the Navy, the Air Force, the Marines have come out here and looked over our equipment. They have talked about our capabilities and discussions and also discussed some of the capabilities of the equipment that they're on with our soldiers and they've been fascinated by that. Getting to find out what other, the, the host nation is supporting us, what they use when it comes to air defense and found out that a lot of the language is common. Um, the second benefit is getting to work with other people, other members of our armed forces, the Marines and the active duty counterparts that we have over here um, and, and the Patriot batteries and the High Mars batteries that are here on our LSA. Um, so, getting to do all that, getting to see cool things, and also this is our AT period, so we're getting to train. So we're having a very useful AT period out here. We're on our LSA 24-7, so it's training 24-7. There's not a lot of knocking it off and going back to the home station. Um, very often? Yeah, yeah, so the, the live fire that we're gonna be doing out here, uh, one of them is the common live fire that we do at our annual training period. So we're going to be engaging aerial targets with the M3P 50 cal on our Avenger weapon system here. We're going to certify the, uh, the 12 crews of my battery just like we normally would at an AT period. The main difference is, is one, the location, and two, we're going to be firing off actual Stinger missiles. So we rarely get the opportunity to fire off live Stingers outside of operational deployments and getting ready to to deploy to some of the missions that we get to do as the air defense. Um, the, the time that my soldiers have had putting on the static displays for the, the Filipino military and for the Marines and other units that are walking around in this LSA, you could see their faces light up when they're briefing the uh, Filipino armed forces that have come and played around on the Avenger when we have had the Filipino Army Majors sit down in the turret in the gun tub there, take pictures, hand out patches. Uh, we had some of them here that were handing out reward mugs for who gave the best brief. To see the faces and to hear them in the tents after everybody leaves talk about what a great time they had, that's probably the most rewarding thing. And hearing them say that they will never get to see anything like this again in their lives is just great.